So, my mom, she just got divorced. And she decided she would want to try dating again. So, like, a modern person, she started a dating profile. And she found a man and dated that man. And every, occasionally, we would send her guests. But sometimes, we'd ask her for money. Well, my mother, she thought I was suspicious. And eventually, her paranoia got to her. So, in that paranoia, on the specific day, she was feeling hurtful. And in her mood, she accused me of catfishing her. In response, I told her, I don't have enough time for that. I don't even have enough time for my own love life. Because I don't. I don't have time for that. I don't fall in love. I haven't. I've tried, I spent years almost begging, well, I, I would even say begging, people to love me, but you know, I didn't fall in love, I, I have my own hopes and dreams, and you know what? I quit love. Because I would never feel it. Let's say I started when I, like seriously searching for love when I was 18. And then every day for five years, I would talk to these people. I would go to parties, I would find a random stranger and would share an experience. And you know what? With all that time I gave it, it made me feel bad. I wasn't finding love. I didn't fall in love. I was hurt tremendously over and over by anyone and everyone. I would I would hang out with friends. I would chat up people on the internet. I would go back and forth for years with a tremendous amount of strangers. And you know what? I, I never really gave any of them a chance to talk to me. I've met a few of them. And it was just... It never worked out. And at these parties, I would go around kissing them, and that sounds awful. It was like a, f a man whore. You know what? After I turned 23, I was done. And I still feel done to this day. And 
whenever someone brings up my love life, I feel attacked now. Cause they act like I I didn't give up all that I was to find just one person. Just one who would love me forever. But you know what? It's okay. Well, because, well, I don't know. I feel attacked, yes, by like dating sites because they feel that they can sell you a relationship. Everyone, all of those sites feel like they can sell you on a stranger. I'm supposed to love you. And I've tried them all. I tried all the dating sites for every kind of person. And you know what? I didn't find anything because I'm not meant for anybody. I'm meant for me. There doesn't even have to be me. And I'm happy with that. And I tried to undercut all the ads and tell people that I'm not interested. And they don't listen. People don't want to listen to me. When I talk, I'm not heard. When I speak, when I write, I'm not, I'm not understood. Sure, I, I can mean something to myself, but I don't want my feelings to be dismissed when it comes to love. Because everyone deserves love. Even if it's just loving yourself. And when you attack someone for that, it's, it's destructive, it's hurtful. And every chance I had at love, I myself wasn't interested. I could have fought for the people who showed interest in me. I could have traded numbers or really sought someone out. But I'm 25. I'm not getting younger. I'm not going to fall in love. I read a study that says that a person usually falls in love with their significant other statistically before they turn 21. I never felt that way about anyone. And I don't expect myself to. I think love is a learned behavior. And I, I don't want to give time to be taught that. Because I don't have to. It's hurtful. And everyone tells you that in a jokingly matter that you're better off alone. Because you are in most scenarios.